Good evening, everyone. A great late night rally. We're finishing off our last case of 2015 Bowman's Best Baseball. This is uh, random team break number 17 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Old school, too, back in 2015 right here. So big thanks to these folks for digging deep and rallying on our last night of the week right here, back on Tuesday. No Padres in this set. Uh, sometimes there's like a numbered card, but we'll randomize that to one person in the break at the end if there are uh, any Padres. All right, so let's randomize each list. One and a six. Sorry, I have a lozenge in my mouth. One and a six, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That was one and a six, seven times. After seven times, we've got Kaz on top. We got Chris in the number 29 spot. And seven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Poor Padres, says Joe P. There's seven times right there. Indians down to Rockies. Don't worry, they, they make up for it in, in 16 and 17 products. All right. Cosmo with the Indians. Dave Barrows with the Tigers. Travis, you got my Dodgers. Karen with the Diamondbacks. Colin with the Red Sox. Chris P with the Mariners. Hayes with the Reds. Todd with the Brew Crew, Sam Golden with the Giants, Thomas Johnson, you got the Marlins, EA with the Rays, Jeff G with the Astros, TJ with the Mets, Allen with the White Sox, Mike Koontz with the Orioles, Colin, you got the Twins, Manuel with the Pirates, Travis with the Rangers, you got two blue teams, Travis, right? Uh, Hayes with the Cubbies, nice, EA with the A's, Kevin Crouch with the Nationals, Last Spot Mojo, Phillies, Jeff Ranch with the Angels, Rex, you got the Blue Jays, Eric with the Cardinals and the Yankees, Nancy with the Royals, EA with the Braves, and Chris with the Rockies. Let's sort by a team. Any trades? Let me know if there's any trades, folks. And remember, we've been going through the checklist Make sure you keep uh, that checklist in mind. Remember, this is 2015. Jeff Ranch is asking uh, maybe Angels for Cubs, Angels for Astros, perhaps. Red Sox or Rockies for trade. Travis has Dodgers and uh, Rangers. He's looking for Red Sox or Rockies. And it looks like Chris is looking for the Giants from Sam. We'll give it a few more seconds. Oh, Mariners or Rocks for Giants. Not sure if Sam is here at the moment. All right, trade window going once. Trade window going twice. Trade window closed. TWC, trade window closed.
All right. On the 24th, Random Team 17 of the old 2015 edition of Bowman's Best Baseball. This is the, if you remember, this is the set that has those, uh, those high def cards, which are on a thicker card stock. And a lot of the players that were just, uh, that were just kind of hot prospects, just highly rated prospects, are now, now legit big leaguers. All right, good luck, folks. There's uh, four up front, four in the back, eight total on this one. <clears throat> good luck, everybody. I'll keep a checklist nearby so in case there's any... Uh, Parallels or redemptions and whatnot. I think I think the redemptions in this set are expired, but only just recently. So if you get a big name, um, if you call tops, they may be able to help you out. Their phone number's right there. Instead of instead of emailing them or trying to redeem it through the site. It's a little hot under the studio lights, especially during a break like this. Okay, here we go. Good luck, everyone. Jeff Renish wants me to pull a uh, pull a trout, just like we did last night. Jeff Renish got randomized the Angels. He's going trout fishing. Hopefully, we we can have a nice catch. Oh yeah, these cards are these last ones are the those uh, HD cards, the high def cards. Um, Jeff, right? Goldenthal, are you D Lemon HD? Am I getting that right? These are in different spots. All right, well, there it is. Kevin Plowecki. Some of these are numbered, some of these are atomic, some of these are, uh, are um, what should I call it, autographed too. It's the end of my week, folks, so. Not as, not as sharp at this moment. I'm just kind of breaking on autopilot now. I'll just might as well show you this one too. Big Boppy, David Ortiz. For the Red Sox, that goes to Colin. All right, now let's go. I think. The autographs are li literally the second card right here. So Rafael Devers reveals a Jorge Mateo. <coughs> Excuse me. Throat's all dry. I'm losing my voice. Jorge Mateo. Uh, I think he's on the A's now, but this still goes to the Yankees. This goes to, uh, well, EA both has the Yankees and the A's. Corey Seager, Atomic Jorge Soler, and the next auto is Josh Naylor for the Marlins. Tom Johnson with that one. <coughs> Excuse me. 
Where's my Where's my Baseball America list? I think Josh Naylor is on that list now. He's supposed to be a pretty highly rated prospect. I thought I saw his name on this list. Maybe. Maybe not. Not yet, anyway. Then we got Prince Fielder, 41 out of 99. <coughs> we'll do the uh, left-right randomizer on this one. All right. Next one. Oh, just a parallel. We got Carlos Gomez out of 150. It's for the Astros. That'll be for Jeff. Oh, there's the autograph. Behind Luis Severino is Michael Chavez <clears throat> for the Red Sox. Colin with the Red Sox. And there's Manuel Margot. There's Manny Margot, who's on the Padres. This will still go to the Red Sox, Colin. That goes to you, man. Nice. But keep an eye on him in San Diego. I feel like he could uh, definitely turn out to be someone pretty significant for the Padres. All right. Next one. Manuel Margot was a pretty highly rated prospect in that nice Red Sox organization. You know, and I think got dealt in the in the uh, Kimbrel deal. And he's just starting to bear fruit for the uh, for the Padres right now. He used to be in the same spot every time. Which is not it. That's it right there. Got him. All right. Good luck, everyone. Didn't he retire? I think Mark Appel was kind of a highly rated prospect. And, all right, now we got another red team. Ooh, Nationals. Wilmer Defoe. Nice rookie auto for the Nationals. Kevin Crouch with that one. I don't know. I don't remember off the top of my head if Nick Castellanos is in this one. He would be a Tiger, I think. Nice Justin Upton, Padres edition. So no vet base ships, but that little inserts like that will ship. Redemption. Dixon Machado. Where does, where does Dixon go? He's a Dixon Machado's a tiger, actually, David Barrows. There you go. So now even though that's expired, um, instead of uh, instead of trying to redeem it online, try to give Tops a call. Because if you try to redeem it, it'll just be like it'll just deny you outright. But I've heard, um, I've heard, uh, I've heard tale, I've heard a, a tale told that calling them actually, actually helps It'll give you yield better results. Oh, Castellanos is not. 
I'm actually looking at the checklist now. I actually don't see a Nick Castellanos. So yeah, maybe he's in the following year, Joe P. Yeah, Joe P's like, maybe he's in 2016? Around here somewhere, either 15 or 16. I think 16 then. Yeah, I don't see him on the 15 checklist. Garrett Whitley for the Rays. Isn't he an ass? No, that's Forrest. Forrest. Are they related? Goes to the Rays. That'll be for EA Sports. It's in the game. Corey Seager refractor. And behind Tyler J is Braxton Davidson. Green, 21 out of 99. Going to the Braves, that'll be for EA. And another parallel, there's Tyler J, 20 out of 99. For the Twins. Future pitching prospect for the Twins. They really need guys like Tyler J. Their offense seems to be pretty set. Nice high def Noah Syndergaard. That goes to the Mets. TJ for the Mets. A Judge Stanton mirror image? I think that's that's in 2017, isn't it? And then Tyler Glass now. Probably him or Glass now or, or Tyon would be the, the number ones now, Manuel, now that Garrett Cole is gone. All right, next box. Oh, or do the, I don't know. Actually, I'll, I'll keep an eye out. Oh, yeah, there is a Stanton Judge mirror image. I think there's another one in 2017, too. But I, I, I do see one. Yeah, you know what? You're right. Because the one in the 2017 set also sells really well, too. Well, and you know what? That's 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 a that's a left-right randomizer anyway. There you go. So technically, it's not numbered, so it's still still part of that left-right randomizer, but I will sleeve it up for whoever gets it, so whether it's the Marlins and Tom Johnson or the Yankees and, uh, and EA. Nice Lucas Giolito for the Nationals. Kevin Crouch. Lucas Giolito on the White Sox now. Still go to the Nationals. Should be a pretty... Uh, I didn't even finish opening up these packs. Should be pretty solid. Kind of was 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 well re highly regarded as like a top prospect for a long time. And then... Um, 
and then kind of not did not do well. Let's put them all in one stack here. Did not do well. Then got shipped off to the uh, got shipped off to the White Sox. Still didn't do well. But then kind of turned it around last year in the minors, and then should make the should make the should make the big club right out of camp. All right, good luck, everybody. Next one, Giants maybe Giants colors? No, Orioles. DJ Stewart for the O's. That'll go to Mike Koontz. Sean Newcomb for the Angel Angels. Isn't he on? Is he on the Braves now? This is Angels edition. That'll go to Jeff Rennish, I think, who has the on the on Hells. There's a uh, blue Joey Votto to 150. That'll go to the Reds for Hayes. Next autograph is Jacob Wilson for the Cardinals, EA, with the cards. Ah, you sure did, Jeff. And Jeff's like, hey, I got a hit. Uh, C Chef, what's going on? Uh, we're saying, does Bowman Draft Picks come with the rookies with their respective teams? Uh, yes, they may be in their, they may be in their, um, in their minor league uniform or something like that. But I, the picture, but it, it does have their team logo on it. There's Nelson Cruz, Joe P saying, I still haven't gotten a hit yet. Don't worry, Jeff. Don't feel guilty. Joe P's not even in this break. And that's why he hasn't gotten a hit yet. He, you can't hit if you don't get your at-bats in. All right, that's for the Mariners. That'll be for Chris Paradiso. And then, nice high-def Mike Trout for Jeff Rennish and the Angels. <laughs> I wanted to He's like, I wanted to. Slow money don't make money. This is true. Slow money don't make money. the where's the high def card there it is I think I hope that was the high def card is this the high def card this is the high def card what's this oh maybe there's three high def cards oh that means one of them might be the the atomic or maybe an autographed one or something like that oh yeah Joe P what it what Joe P saying you tore it up at spring training today what did, did you get did you get some at bats in did, did the Diamondbacks let you take some swings? They're like, hey, Joe P, you, you look like an athlete, you know? Open tryout for Joe, oh, for the autos. What, who, did you, who did you score? Uh, if, you, if you don't know, folks, Joe P, who lives in Arizona, we, we actually met up with him uh, when we were at the Tops Industry Conference, which is nice. It was good to have a couple drinks with Joe P and hang out. Um, oh, this is a, also a high def card. Maybe one of those aren't. Anyhow, uh, Joe P takes a couple weeks off because he lives in Arizona. He takes a couple weeks off this time of year to go autograph hunt. He has a little daughter too, so they get out there, get get a little fresh air, and uh, and they track down autographs uh, all from the different minor league camps that are out there. So today he got looks like he was at at Giants camp. He got McCutcheon, nice Brandon Crawford, Joe Panic, and Rudnett Odor. 
And also got Nomar Mazzara for the Rangers. Nice. That's a good haul. Nomar Mazzara and Rootnet Odor for the Rangers. There's Joey Gallo, speaking of the Rangers. 49 out of 99. Rangers. Travis Neve with the Joey Gallo. That might be his home run RBI numbers. 49 home runs, 99 RBIs. It's possible. He's got that potential. Oh, you got Gallo the other day? Nice. All right. Right here we have Trent Clark for the Brewers. Nice one for the Brew Crew. That goes out to Hot Toddy. Uh, Dodgers got destroyed by the Giants today in a in one half of a split squad game. I think they got beat by the Royals today too. So now, Joe P, Dodgers going 0-162. Terrible team. Garbage team. Blow it up. <laughs> Blow it up. Start over. Trade Cody Bellinger. Trade Clayton Kershaw. Ash Russell for the Royals. Speaking of the Royals, that'll go to Nancy. They, yesterday they, they won. So I was just like, yeah, 162-0. and Best team ever, Dynasty. Today, it's spring training. Everyone's supposed to overreact in spring training. All your prospects are going to turn out to be awesome. No one's going to slump. No one's going to have a sophomore slump. But I did learn something, though, when I was watching that game before I came into the store. Uh, that the youngest player on that Giants team, or on the Giants starting lineup, I think, the youngest player of the projected starting lineup, Joe Panic, and he's like 29. They've got it. They kind of have an old team. Got to get that team younger. There's Tuki Toussaint. You actually signed something, Tuki? Oh, it was 2016 where he didn't sign. That goes to uh, EA Sports and the Braves. All right. Let's see. One of these cards aren't. That's a high def card. That's also a high def. Aha, this wasn't. What's going on here? All right, so, ah, there we go. Nice Archie Bradley. Joe P, what, what are your Diamondbacks going to do with Archie Bradley? You're going to stretch him out to a starter, or he's going to be that sort of, uh, that eighth inning guy, eighth or ninth inning guy. Who he was he was very effective at, at, at two to playing that two three innings at a pop, but this is a one per case atomic refractor of these high death cards, so this will go to Karen and the Diamondbacks. Maybe they'll stretch him out to a starter. All right, their rivals, Clint Kershaw. That is for the Dodgers. Travis Neve with the Dodgers. The other one is Robinson Cano for the Mariners. Chris Paradiso with the Cano. Halfway through this eight box break, ladies and gentlemen. Four boxes to go, 16 autos, autos to go. So still a lot of chances for everybody. Save the high def card. I like saving those high def cards till the end. Let's just stack both of the mini boxes right on top. Conserve the real estate here. 
on my break table. Good luck, everybody. So we're just about halfway through. I don't know why this break take, seems to take longer than the 2016 or 17 editions, but for some reason it does. Maybe it's the extra high def cards that are making that issue. But anyhow. We have Anthony Rizzo. Ooh. Nice Anthony Rizzo autograph for Hayes and the Cubs. There you go, Hayes. That's pretty strong. Next auto behind Braden Shipley is another Anthony Rizzo. Come on, Hayes. What kind of sorcery is this? Two Anthony Rizzos. No. Your, your eyes do not deceive you, sir. Count them. One and two. Grade one, sell one. That's what I say. Grade one, sell one. There's Ryan Braun. Out of 150. And Joe P's favorite player, Luke Weaver, for the Cardinals. That goes to EA Sports. Joe P, I'm sure EA, Eric will give you a good price for this. Hey, you're welcome, Ace. You are welcome. And I think you only have, sorry, uh, your question from before, I think you only got one team in this, right? I only have you for one. Maybe you have two. Where's your, what's your other team? You have Cubs. Oh, you have Cubs and Reds, Cubs and Reds. And a redemption. Remember, these are these are expired redemptions. But I think if you if you call tops, you may uh, you may be able to you may be able to convince them to send you Stephen Matz. I'm sure they have plenty of Stephen Matzes to send you. All right, so there you go, Mets, TJ. Let's see what these high def cards are going to be. Jose Bautista, Blue Jays, nice. That'll that high def card will go to Rex and the Blue Jays. And the other high def card is Chris Sale. Chris Sale for oh, this is White Sox edition of Chris Sale. So Allen gets that. Oh, Carlos saying Vertex down to 18. And guess what? It's Barros and Carlos who did officially get spots in that Vertex, bringing it down to 18. So, Carlos, thank you very much, sir. Putting his money where his mouth is. Who's next? So, this, this should take about another... I don't know. I think this, this break should take about another 20 minutes. 15, 20 minutes, something like that. If it doesn't fill up by the by the end of this break, then I think we're just gonna call it a night, but I hope we can rally. I don't mind going a little late for Vertex because it's only a 20 minute break, it's very quick. This is the long break right here. But we're almost done, we're only three boxes away. But Vertex is quick. It's a short break time-wise. And it just feels short just because it's just it just hits, it's boom, 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 and then we're done. So this is your last chance, folks, before we break for the weekend, and then I'll be back on Tuesday night.
If you don't want to wait till Tuesday night, I know Dave Barrows doesn't want to wait until Tuesday. I know Carlos doesn't want to wait until Tuesday. I personally don't want to wait until Tuesday. I don't, I don't want to leave this this four box inner just sitting there. So if you don't want to wait, that's the high def card. If you don't want to wait, you got to do it now. Yeah, Carlos is also saying, hey, he's trying to trying to wheel and deal a little bit too. He's like, I'll get one or two more teams, but he's got to see some help from others. Now or never, folks. Literally, we're down to the wire. Or we could just let the case marinate over the weekend, but I'd rather just see what's in here now. I, th I think it's I think it's ready to go now. Links in the chat. All right, the autograph is Ian Happ. Wow, what a break for the Cubs. Hayes with Ian Happ. What's the haps for Hayes? He's supposed to be. I think Joe Madden wants to use him like a, like the like his next Ben Zobrist. That's the kind of quality he has. That kind of, the kind of versatility. And if you remember, Ben Zobrist in his heyday, in his hay was was like a, a fantasy baseball monster. Is that another Cub? Cavante Mitchell, another Cub. I don't know anything about Cavante Mitchell, sorry. No info on Cavante and Mitchell. I'll, I'll fire my producers. There's Brennan Rogers, 71 on 99. One Trevor Story injury away. I mean, I don't want to wish injury on Trevor Story, but for the hobby, it'll be good. Chris Heston. I think he... I, would, I have nothing on Chris Heston, sorry. I feel like he had like a, he had a good start against the Dodgers. Maybe, did he throw a no-hitter against, or almost throw a no-hitter against the Dodgers? Maybe that was some other per, some other, some other pitcher. Ty Black, maybe. Josh Naylor. And the other autograph is Y and L, Yoan Lopez for the Diamondbacks. I don't know what's going on with Yoan Lopez. Karen, there you go. Karen, you, I'm sure you'll do your due diligence. Unless I see his card here and there's information on the back. Where's Jake Arrieta gonna sign? We just saw his base card fly by. Hi, <coughs> excuse me, high def cards. <coughs> Luis Severino, who I think may very well be the the ace of that Yankees rotation. Goes to EA and the Yanks. We have Kyle Schwarber. Hayes just can't stop hitting. Nice high def card for Hayes and the Cubs. Two boxes to go, boys and girls. Two boxes to go. Good luck. Def card. We'll stack both mini boxes on top of each other. And the 
should be the other one. Okay, great. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Second to last box, the autograph right up on top. Michael Conforto reveals another bluish team, Dylan Tate for the Rangers. He's on the Yankees now. And he's a high round pick, high, uh, high first round. I think it's like third overall or something like that from UC Santa Barbara. He was the first time UC Santa Barbara sent a first rounder to baseball, but kind of up and down minor league career. That's, that's something to hold on to, Travis Sneeve. Hold on to that, see what he turns out to be. Is that the other autograph already? What is this? Chris Sale? No, just, just the box trolling me. That's an autograph. That's got to be Frankie Montas. Frankie Montas for the White Sox. I think he went to the Dodgers, and I think the Dodgers traded him somewhere else. But that one still goes to the White Sox. That goes to Alan Murdoch. Uh, no, um, Santa Barbara is the home of the Gauchos, I believe. The Banana Slugs are Santa Cruz, a little bit further north. D. Gordon, still Marlins edition in 1999. And Derek Fisher for the Astros. Not that Derek Fisher, but Derek Fisher, the baseball player. I don't think they I don't think they have any relation, Jeff Goldenthal. No relation to the other Derek Fisher. Just throwing these cards around. Uh, Atomic Michael Conforto. There's another autograph right here. It is Colby Allard for the Braves. Not sure what Colby Allard is up to. EA with the Braves. All right. High def cards, what do you got for us? Yasmani Tomas for Karen and the Snakes. And JP Crawford for the Phillies. I think JP Crawford might see work, might do some work this year with the Phillies on the big club, right? think. I'm not sure. Maybe he's already... I think he's going to play every day. <coughs> All right. Last four autographs and parallels. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for filling this up. After this break is over in a separate video, there will be a randomizer between this random team break and including the Pick Your Team break of Bowman's Best from 2016. We'll randomize those two breaks, the names from those two breaks, and the name on top, winner take all, $50 of break credit. All right, so thank you everyone for filling this up. We'll see who wins the dollar dollar bills. $50 can go a long way. You can save it. You can use it tonight. You can save it for the new releases next week. Should be the high def card. Yes. Put that right there. High def, there we go. Okay, here we go. Final box. Final two mini boxes. Autograph is Bradley Zimmer. It's a solid one for the tribe. That goes to Kaz and the Cleveland Indians.
Cespedes Atomic. I like those refractors. And the autograph is behind Josh Naylor is Dansby Swanson. Diamondbacks edition. And that goes to Karen and the Diamondbacks. Nice. Obviously on the Braves now. I think people got fired in the Diamondbacks organization for that move. And nice orange, Manny Machado, 14 out of 25. Orange for the Orioles, Mike Koontz. Let's see, 14, what is that? How many years you'll get? No, maybe. <laughs> maybe we'll get like eight, eight, eight years and a bunch of money. Behind Frankie Montas is Paul Tucker. For the Pirates, it goes to Manuel with the Pirates. To be fair, that Dansby Swanson deal, even though he's first overall, they thought that Shelby Miller was going to be a lot better than he ended up being. I think Shelby Miller kind of cracked under that pressure. And wow, Walker Bueller. He's got an outside chance of being your rookie of the year this year. Highly rated Dodgers prospect. Not a prospect anymore. He's going to have to be an everyday player pretty soon. Nice Vanderbilt kid right there. That goes to Travis Neve and the Dodgers. That's a big one. Dodgers, Dodgers organization, very high on him. There's Kyle Tucker. Four out of five, Kyle Tucker. We're ending with a train whistle, folks. Wow. That goes to the Astros, Jeff Goldenthal. Let's look at the high defs first really quick. We've got Adrian Gonzalez for the Dodge, still Dodgers edition here. I'm going to miss his walk-up music at Dodger Stadium. Mariachi Loco, which is a great song. And there's Tuki Toussaint high def for EA. And the Braves still have some randomizers to do, but first things first. For the Astros, Jeff Goldenthal, four out of five, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. That's a strong one right there. Excellent. All right, we got a couple left right randomizers. Now, I know this has value, but still part of the left right randomizer. It's not a separate, it's not like a different numbered card or anything like that. Okay. So let's go back to random.org. Let me grab a new list here. Left, right, randomizer. Let's randomize that. Uh, five and a three, eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Right side will get them after eight times. So all the right side teams. We'll get it. So there you have it, folks. That's it. That was Random Team Rig number 15, number 17 of 2015, Bowman's Best Baseball, here on a Saturday. Thanks very much, everyone. More on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.